Welcome back to What The Face. Glad you're here. And a few days ago, well, maybe a week, I guess, by now, I was speaking to Randy uh, Wright, and we were talking back and forth about the other versions of the Occam's Razor. Now, he knows that I use an Occam's Razor, the Nano, but he said, how good is the previous one, the one that came first? I said, I really don't know. So, uh... Randy bought one, and he said, he said it was fantastic. Um, so, I bought one too, and that's what you see here. Uh, I uh, wanted to give it a shot. You never know. Maybe this one's good too. I'll judge it personally. Nothing against uh, Randy and his judgment, because we all see things differently. But I hope to have come up with the same conclusion as Randy did. So, uh, let me uh, open this up and see what we got here. In fact, I will use this primitive scissor. Very primitive tool. There you go. Oh, wow. Okay. Sorry. <clears throat> All right. Finally. I'm glad there wasn't another package. Well, there actually is. There it is. Okay, so this is the box. Occam's Razor. I got the rose gold. If you can see that. The rose gold. Put it this way. And uh, going to open it up. There's a... I guess it's a, a slip. Yeah. So let's take this out of the way. Let's move that. Put back the scissors. And let's just open this. Oh, it's very pretty. So let me adjust the camera. Let me go down to a little bit. So this has the same two dot plate that I use it's already attached it's actually ready to go I just need to put a a blade in there I didn't order blades because I have a whole bunch of them and they fit in this one too um, these are the extra plates there's a one dot and a three dot see it right there three dots and I believe there's a one there's the one dot right there so uh, Again, these are the cards that come with it, same as the other one. These are all the these are all the uh, different types of choices you can have with razor blades. And these are the explanation of the blades. I use the Pro Guard, the one on the bottom. So, with that said. Here, just let you see that. I use the moderate setting. So, with that said, let's bring this to the den and let's do a shave with it. Here we go. Okay, so we're in the den now, and uh, I just brought out the original Occam's razor that I have. Well, not the original. This is this is the Occam's razor nano. So this is the second one that came out. This is the enhanced version. They took all the different things that they think they could improve on the first Occam's Razor and they created the Nano. So this is the one that I was lucky enough to get into a Kickstarter on and I got in at $45 for an early bird special. And you know, if people are looking to get this, I don't think you can anymore. It's gone up in price to about $225, then it lowered to $125. It stayed there. But there are no more for years, for years. So I don't know if it's ever going to come back. Can't tell you. But that's that one. Now, you can get this. This is the first version. This is the first Occam's razor. And you can tell because it doesn't have the hollowed out handle. See? And there are also other improvements. This is 
uh, more extended out than the uh, than than the uh, second version, which is right here. I'll let you see that. I don't know if you can actually see the differences, but there they are anyway. So with that, I'm going to put a blade in here, and I'm going to be using the Pro God blade right here. I'll just take one out. See, taking one out. And then I'm going to place it into the back of the razor, like this. And then you push it in until it clicks. Click, click, there it is. So you can see it right there. Sorry if it wasn't on camera, but you get the idea, right? You don't have to see me push it through. Um, Again, the two dot, the two dots, that's the plate I'm using. Um, I will be using frozen lemon ice for this shave. So two, two things that I love the most, menthol, besides my wife, menthol and uh, frozen lemon ice, uh, lemon. That's uh, two things I love, really. And the combination of the both, perfect for me anyway. Uh, so I'm going to do a bowl lather and then bring that to the face and, and then we'll do a shave. So stay tuned. Don't go away. Okay, so as you can see, I have um, already put the soap in the bowl because the focus is really on the razor itself. And here is the um, wet the face brush. So let me put some warm water on that. Let's empty the contents of the brush in there. If I need to add more water, I will. So let's... Uh, Let's just do the, the lathering. So here goes. Here we go. Never give up. It'll happen. That lemon scent is all over the den. All right. Let's get this going. All right. So, let's take this and uh, bring it to the face and do the shave. So here we go. Okay, so I have about um, six to seven days growth, so let me wet the face. Here is the, <laughs> here's the lather, so let me apply it. Nothing better. Oh boy. If you like lemons and menthol, this is for you. You go. All right, let me just wash my hand, dry my hands. All right. Okay, here is the Occam's razor. Just gonna wet a little bit. Here we go.
So far, so good. This was uh, 50 something dollars. I like the rose gold, the rose gold. It's a nice looking razor. It's a little heavier than the the Nano because of the cutout. But it hasn't really you know it hasn't that hasn't made a difference at all. As you can see, I'm going the, practically the same speed as I always go. Now, one of the things that they said was that uh, people, because they shortened the the front, people couldn't get under their nose, they claim. So we'll give that a try. Wow, nothing like it, man. There is really nothing like this razor. Why the heck is this guy not producing this? It just doesn't make any difference. Doesn't make any sense to me. I did get underneath the nose pretty well, but the other the other razor does a better job of uh, doing that. But it's not like it's it's not impossible. You've got to. You gotta be aware of it, and you just adjust. Oh man. I think I have another great razor. You know. A definite alternative to if the other one breaks, then I have this one. Uh, Randy was right. It's basically no difference. Wow. And you know, the cleanup is like, it's like nothing. Let me do... Oh boy, how fantastic is this? Excellent, excellent. So what am I gonna put on for an aftershave? You know what, I don't have, I'm just gonna go with Ice Blue Aqua Velva. I don't know, it probably doesn't go, but it, it'll, it'll be fine. It's fine, wow. So, with that, I say, if you're looking for an Occam's razor and you don't know when the one that I use is coming back, well, get this one while they last, because I don't know how many more there are in stock. Uh, you know, he doesn't seem like he's producing any more razors, so uh, go get it. And I had a great shave. And I hope you have a great shave. And I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.